Hi, I'm Dr. Kevin Short, and I'd just like to talk a little bit about uh, ankle sprains. So your typical ankle sprain is where your foot goes towards the midline of your body and your leg goes outwards. Uh, people most commonly attribute it to basketball injuries where people jump up and down. They step on someone's sneaker and it causes their ankle to roll out. Um, this is a, can be a, a pretty mild situation or it actually can be um, something that's more involved. There's ligaments on the outside of the ankle, specifically your anterior talofibular ligament, which can be sprained, strained, or sometimes can even tear in this injury. Only an MRI would be able to uh, find out the information about what type of injury you have. But what most patients don't understand is, is that this injury needs to be immobilized immediately. So typically if people would come into my office, I would put you in a brace so that your ankle could move up and down. However, that you can't go side to side due to immobilizing the ligament. I typically have people in these braces for about four to six weeks, followed up by um, icing and elevating their, layer, the, their lower extremity. And typically after you do this, you then put people into a higher type shoe, which will also immobilize motion um, in that plane. Like I said before, if patients sometimes don't heal from conservative treatment, sometimes they need to go on to surgery. Now a surgical procedure repairs the actual ligament on the outside of their ankle joint and that typically will immobilize them for about another 8 to 12 weeks depending on the procedure that's done. One thing that patients need to be wary about is that they don't want to go into range of motion and physical therapy too quick. That the actual ligament itself needs to be immobilized and scarred down and they have to make sure that they don't go ahead and move it around too much so that it can heal properly because if it isn't immobilized they can go on to lead to chronic pain and chronic ankle instability, which is a severe problem and in most cases needs to go on to have a procedure done.